So in this video, we are going to see how the shuttle sort fares in sorting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 into ascending order. So a list that's already in ascending order, how good is the algorithm? Okay. So first of all, we're going to compare 1 and 2 together. They're already in the correct order, so no swap is required. So on the first pass, we make one comparison. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We then bring in 3. 2 and 3 get compared. Okay, They're already in the correct order, so no swap is necessary. So on the second pass, we make one comparison. So we now have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then we bring in 4. 4 gets compared with 3. They're already in the correct order, so there is no swap necessary. So on the third pass, we make one comparison. And then one, two, three, four, five. We bring in five. Five gets compared with four. One comparison, no swaps. So on the fourth pass, we make one comparison. So you can see that the total number of comparisons for uh, a list with five numbers that are already in ascending order um, is actually four. So if this had been a list of n numbers, then the total number of compar in ascending order, if the total number of, uh, had been n, then the total number of comparisons uh, would be n minus one. So that's telling you that if the list is in already in ascending order, and you need to put the, use the shuttle sort to put the numbers into ascending order, then it would be order n complexity. Okay, so the total number of comparisons would be n minus 1.